I really am going nuts with these plant haul videos, but like I can't control myself. Somebody needs to like take my credit card away. Hey guys, Noah here. So I am going to be showing you in this video two unboxings. One of them is from Plantarina and the other one is from an Etsy shop that I'll link down below that I discovered that I actually really, really like. So I'll link it down below and I'll link Plantarina for you, but I'm sure you guys all have heard of her shop already. She's really big here on YouTube. So I'm so excited to share with you guys what I unboxed this week. I did have to film it like two separate times because I didn't really know when I was gonna receive the packages and the plant arena came when I was like, just woke up in the morning. And then the Etsy one came like when I was, I had to like run out the door, like I didn't have time and I didn't wanna leave it in the box. I really wanted to unbox it as soon as I got it. So I ended up filming it on my cell phone. So I just really took pictures of it just so I could share with you guys straight out of the box what it looks like and let's get into it. Hey guys, so excuse the look today i literally was just having my morning coffee and look what came in the mail i'm so excited this is my first order ever from plantarina.com i've been obsessed with her videos i literally have them on in the background all day my son is here for the unboxing so i'll stay here let me show you my son real quick he wants to open him come let's say hi to the camera he's like who are you talking to you see yourself on the camera hello you just woke up from a nap. Yeah, it's you. Aren't you so cute? He gives the best kisses. All right, so let's open this box up. You can sit right next to me, Lyric. You sit right there and you help me, okay? Yeah, you can help me. This is hard to do. I probably shouldn't be moving the box around this much, but trying to get it in the camera frame was not easy. So I got two plants from there, both small size, because I like to watch my plants grow from being babies, so... Oh my god, it looks so cute! So here's the plants. Alright, so this first one I got is the Syngonium Gold Illusion. <laughs> kind of it looks good it looks really good actually it just sucks that it's in the mail for so long you know um, but she packages it up so well none of the dirt fell out everything's paper so it's recyclable i feel like i need to get this one some water pretty quickly she's actually very dry so i'm gonna get her some water and give her some sunlight real quick the next one is why place the order i just wanted this plant so bad be careful eric it's a pothos pictos or a silver pothos and this one actually looks amazing oh my god look at those colors <gasps> i love this one like it even has like it's actually pretty large for like the small size that she sells it as it has great nodes already so i could even propagate this one but i won't let it grow a little bit I have these dowels that she uses mm. Because, hey, stop, he's stopping the plant. Um, because I could use these for other plants. Um, I actually need something to prop up my uh, Monstera Edisoni that's been blossoming. But oh my God, this one is such a win. Look at the this plant. So yeah, these are the two babies that I got from Plantarina. They both look fantastic, honestly. This one is just in desperate need of water. Pothos can take any sort of water or light that you give them so this one's just thriving even in the box but i'm so excited to have these i do have another package to unbox for you guys it's an order that i placed off of etsy and that's coming tomorrow so i'm gonna put these two together so you'll be able to see both unboxings <laughs> and with that we say goodbye huh yeah don't hit me <laughs> All right, so the first plant I got from the Succulent Depot um, Etsy shop is the String of Dolphins. I'm actually very surprised with how full it came. I wasn't aware that it would come this full. Uh, it did come without a pot at all, as you can see in the photo that I'm inserting. So I did quickly pot it into my own pot. Uh, I think this might even be too small for it. I'm not sure. I feel like I might want to replant it again. Uh, the soil is pretty dry, so I might even do that today. I also want to do a propagating 
string of dolphins video this one i'm gonna show you guys up close it already has so much new growth on it it came very very healthy i did um, have one long strip right here that cracked off um, in shipping but i mean it's, i'm actually using it to propagate it so it's totally fine so i've been watching a lot of youtube videos on the care for these and all the string plants kind of seem like they're not that easy to care for, but this did seem like one of the more easier of the string plant, you know, gene or whatever species. So I'm excited for this. I can't wait till it's like trailing down. It's going to look so pretty. I'm planning on hanging it up on my curtain rod in my bedroom. So I'll show you guys that on Instagram if you guys want to see that. Go ahead and follow my Instagram. I'll insert it right here. And that way you'll be able to see like where I end up placing all these plants. But yeah, so cute. So the next one I got, I actually kind of decided I want to collect like the string of plant stuff. Um, I don't know why. I just kind of do. So this is the string of pearls and it's actually got a bloom right here. Oh, I forgot to mention that the string of dolphins did come with a ton of blooms, but I did clip them all off just because I don't like how it looks. I feel so bad, but it is blooming season. So it did come blooming, like already bloomed and a lot more bloomed out as soon as I got it. So I do know that they're very healthy. And now that I'm looking at this, it came very healthy, the string of pearls. But one of them I'll show you looks a little dead. Do you see that one? I don't know why it's like white. If you guys know why that happened, Comment down below and let me know because I heard that this is like the hardest plant to take care of like as far as the string But so do you see like that little baby right there? That was not there when I got it So I can already tell that it's starting to grow down and string down and it's got a ton of new growth up here That was not there So I will be repotting this very soon and hanging it in my bedroom as well So yeah, I'm excited about this one all right, so the last plant I got from the Etsy shop is the String of Hearts. And I was actually pretty surprised with how long the strings were when it arrived. It's also blooming, as you could see right here. I'll show you guys a close-up. Pretty cool, actually. I've never seen that before. So the only thing I would say about this plant is it really only came with two strings. I think maybe there was a string here in the middle, but it does look dead. I got to clip this off. And then maybe this is going to be a third string right here. It's hard to tell. So yeah, I'm excited for this. I do want to propagate it in sphagnum moss very soon, but I will be trimming it to try to propagate it to make this a lot more full. And I want it to be like, you know, beautiful hanging plant. And I'm also hanging this in my bedroom. I'm going to hang them all three together. So it's going to look really, really good. You guys definitely need to follow my Instagram so you don't miss out on that. All right, so those are all the plants that I received. You saw my Plantarina haul, you saw my Etsy plant haul. Let me know which plant was your favorite and if you have any tips on the care for these plants, I would actually love to hear it in the comments down below because this is my first time really owning any of these plants and I've been like so scared to kill them that I literally check on them every single day. But I do know that when you do that, you tend to overwater. So I'm definitely like being mindful of that and not overwatering. So really hoping that I can do like an updated video for you guys and that they all look nice and healthy. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching my video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.